What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to a brand new video and in this video I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to create a thug life effect and I know I have done this in the past but people keep asking on the videos like dude can you please make a video about how to make the thug life effect in Vegas Pro 15 and you know the second reason of all that I'm making this tutorial is because I can. So I'm going to teach you guys exactly how to make the thug life effect in this video. So I would say make sure to smash the like button down below already. I would say let's get started. Alright guys, as you guys can see right now, we are in Vegas 15 and I'm going to show you guys exactly how I created that intro with the sunglasses, the music, the joint and the Thug Life Effects logo. So what we're going to do is we're going to put on our headset because there's audio obviously. So let's hear what the clip sounds like. What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to a brand new video. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to create a Thug Life Effect. And I know I have done this in the past, but people People keep asking on the videos like dude can you please make a video about how to make the thug life effect in Vegas Pro 15 and you know the second reason of all that I'm making this tutorial is because I can. Okay, so that's what the, sip, what the clips uh, looks like and sound like. So what we're going to do is we're going to make the, cl uh, the clip freeze right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to play back the video. Yes, I can. And right here, I'm going to create a screenshot. So we're going to go to the diskette icon above the preview screen. I'm going to call this uh, number two. Then what we're going to do is we're going to split on the exact same moment. And we're going to drag in that clip for a second. So if we play back the video, this is what, look, what it looks like. Well, is because I can. So as you can see, that's basically what we want. Now, what we're gonna do in order to make this look like the Hollywood, uh, like the uh, the thug life effect, we're gonna copy this. So we're gonna just press Control C, press Control V. So we're gonna also make this zoom and fade into black and white. So we're gonna go to the video effects tab. We're gonna go to black and white, this one, and we're gonna drag that on top of the second one. So as you can see, if I do it like this, if we, if we make a cross fade, it fades into black and white. Make it a little bit like this. As you can see right now, it is fading into black and white. Now what we're gonna do is we're going, going, gonna go ahead and we're gonna also copy this one, press Control V, and then we're gonna make this guy zoom in a little bit. So we're gonna go to a pan crop of the last one. What we're gonna do is we're gonna just press our uh, uh, keyframe, I would say right here, and then we're gonna just zoom in a little bit. We're gonna also go to the top, as you can see like this. This is what it looks like. So that looks really cool and what we're going to do, uh, we're going to just make uh, the glasses appear right now. So we're going to just go ahead and drag in the glasses. I just found that one on Google, uh, the, the deal with it glasses. I'm going to drag that in one real quick. So as you can see right now, here are the glasses and what we're going to do is we're going to time it when the zoom stops, the glasses will appear like this. So we're going to go ahead and make this a little bit shorter and then we are going to go ahead and click on if and pan crop. Then what we're going to do is we're going to make this guy smaller and we're going to put this guy on our head on the right position. So we're going to go ahead and make it smaller as you can see. If I just go ahead and put it, you know, on me on myself, make it a little bit smaller though. So I think this one looks pretty cool. Then what we're going to do is we're going to drag the first keyframe a little bit more to the uh, to the middle and then we're gonna go ahead and make the the glasses slide in from the top So we're gonna go ahead and make sure that this icon is selected to uh, To up and down Then we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna drag this gla those glasses out of the screen So this is what it looks like Boom, that's really cool. And now we make the glasses uh, slide into the screen. So that's really cool and we're gonna do the exact same thing for the joint place it on the on the on the right position make it slide in I'm gonna do that for the joint as well so I'll catch you guys I'm just, I'm not gonna bore you guys with me doing that I'll just catch you guys when that is done as well Okay, so as you can see right now, I made the joint slide in from the left of the screen. 
So that looks really, really cool. Now what we're going to do is we're going to also make the Thug Life Effect logo appear on the left of us. So create a new video track, drag in the Thug Life Effect logo. This one, as you can see, and for one weird reason, it has a green background. So we're going to remove that one, go to Video Effects, click on Chroma Key, drag the default one on top of the Thug Life Effect. What we're going to do is uncheck it, create, click on this little blue bar, pick the pencil icon and, and click on the green one. Logo is just visible. So that's how to do it. We're going to go ahead and we're going to also so make the logo appear and we're gonna go ahead and replace that logo to the left of us so go to the track motion icon of the uh, thug life logo we're gonna make that a little bit smaller turn it just a little bit sideways and we're gonna place that guy right here now that looks really cool as you can see we're gonna make that logo uh, appear a little bit later than the rest of the of the essentials So now that we have animated everything, what we're going to do is we're going to drag in the GTA San Andreas soundtrack. We're going to drag that in because that, that's used like a lot. So we're going to just drag in that one real quick. Okay, so now that I dragged in the uh, the sound the soundtrack of the song of, of the game, let's, let's see what it looks like. Because I can. So that looks really cool, so let's see what it looks like one more time. So that looks really cool guys, so this is how you create uh, the actual Thug Life effect and obviously you just want to go ahead and just, you know, uh, when, this, when, the, when the effect is done just press, you know, just put the last part of the video just, you know, onto each other and this is what it looks like in total because I can. So I'm going to teach you guys exactly how to make the Thug Life effect in this video. So I would say make sure to smash the like button down below already. I would say let's get started. So that's how to do it guys. This is how you create a Thug Life effect. I hope this video was helpful to you. So that was freaking amazing. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the continued support. And I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new Vegas 15 tutorial. As always on my channel on Tuesday. Because on the entire month of September. I will be uploading a new uh, uh, Vegas Pro 15 tutorial. Every single day. Until October the 1st. So make sure to smash the like button down below. And also let me know your suggestions you want to know. Uh, for future videos. So I will see you guys in the next video. Just Alex Halford.